I don't know really what's going on, but there are some really crazy people out there, I think. Um, I got 51 requests today. Friend requests. And the only thing I get to see here is what most likely are fake profiles. Now, the thing about this is that this stuff here, this is not the only thing. It's not the only thing that I see here. Let me see if this is the account. This is the account. Now look what this is. You know how many I deleted? You have no idea. But it is crazy. It's crazy because of this. There, somebody is bombarding me with what you see here that is, I don't know, obsessed with my new site. It is leaving me some kind of a weird, strange, strange kind of a stuff on the new site. Some kind of comments that are related to the ATM machines, credits, um, expertise in burglaries and stuff like this. It's, it's quite insane stuff that goes on. It's all related to ATMs and stuff like this, uh, expertise on, on It started when they took the card uh, information when they have stolen. Look what this is. I mean, you can make these things up. I mean, this is just, this is like obsession with this. I don't know what's going on with this stuff. But this is what it is. I have deleted already. I don't know how many I deleted. Yeah, so this is this is kind of a weird stuff too, no? Susan Duke, uh, Eve Donald, uh, Jesse Alex, Max William. We approved your whatever unknown left hack crack. Yeah, hack crack, a lot hack crack. Uh, I gotta tell you that strange stuff is happening. That I have realized that they also post some kinds of ads on the different websites that are pertaining to my email addresses and stuff like this. Hmm. That's a quite a deal when you get 51 requests from ladies in one day, right? The thing about it is that these are not these are all fake profiles. This is somebody really, really crazy out there. Really, really crazy. And this person is capable to come up with many profiles like this. It was in Grotniki that I would face something very similar to this, but that somebody would come up with a 51 profiles in just a single day. Now that is kind of a shocking. That is kind of a shocking. That is a little bit extreme, you have to admit that stuff, okay, so just want to bring this to attention. Now, what is today is, just as you see right here, it's a Saturday, November the 2nd, 2019, still it is. Oh. That's a whole lot for one day, I'll tell you that much. I see that this stuff is more related to someone else and it looks like uh, some kind of entertainer or something like this, but it's an individual that is listed basically under every one of these profiles. Uh, homeless and happy. Um, I think that's a message to me. Then I get some more stuff here. Visas. Uh, Visas, I guess for the US or something like this, some kind of crap like this. I see Consulado, USA, uh, Solitaciones, Monica Visas, Mazatian. Um, maybe just somebody from Warsaw or somebody, something like that, I would say. Um, I really would not be surprised about it. Somebody with um, ability to 
play with the law, I would say, with um, do whatever is pleased uh, in this country, I think. I think this is kind of a response on my situation today. Uh, I did... I did spoke about what exactly have this Polish government orchestrated to me here. Uh, in Poland. And it's not a very pretty thing. Seems like they actually proud themselves with this. And this is basically what was all about. This is the main news for today. It's something maybe that is just a mech daddy of abuse, of crime that is worthy to even read about. This is taken from Alser Times news site. Definitely a news that you do want to read. So this was a really, really swift response today I got on this on, on the news of my own which I have published in respect to what happened here to me in Poland. You know, and the only thing I did was I revealed just how criminal network Mr. Donald Trump have managed to assemble here through his servants Kaczynski, Andrzej Duda and Morawiecki. And it seems like the response was you know, outstanding. It does sound like Warsaw to me, the whole thing. Smells like. You know, if you're just going to read this stuff here, it doesn't sound good. The complaint actually it can be seen right here. This is the complaint. The letter which I have also sent to. Not a very good stuff folks, not a very good stuff. Uh, but stuff that is actually happening indiscriminately in front of the nose of the people worldwide. They do not care about the law. They care less about the law. They care about... They don't care about nothing. To them, the law is like... It's like a matter. It's, a, it's like a laughter, the whole thing. The people for whom the laws seems like do not exist. So this was quite an interesting response I got. But it's this kind of response that seems like it did hit the core uh, of the issue really well. That uh, seems like I did I did hit the. Oh, let me just see what else here is. No, for the most part, this here. Homeless and happy, yeah. Okay. Um, I do have some kind of a strange people chasing my new side and stuff. I'll tell you that. Um, actually, quite a lot of strange people. This was recorded again on November the 2nd, 2019.